Hey guys, this is Max from Maximum Survivalist. Today we're going to uh, be looking at my uh, sling bag that I carry. It's an EDC carry. Uh, it's made by uh, Red Rock. It's by Outdoors Gear. Uh, it stains about 12 inches by 8 by 8. When I first done this, uh, decided to, to get me an EDC bag, I said uh, to myself, you don't want to carry in a large bag. Uh, a medium bag is a little too big to carry so I decided to go with the uh, Red Rock uh, it is a sling you can uh, move this sling from right to left uh, me and my wife and kids was uh, done a vacation last week I believe it was I wore this thing about everywhere we went uh, this thing comes with padded back padded shoulders uh, for your shoulder strap is padded pretty thick it's got some d rings it's got molly attachments all over it uh, like i said a pretty good rugged bag the zippers is real real rugged double double stitched here in the zippers it's got a padded uh handle if you need to grab this handle and and haul tail with it uh, when you have this bag on your shoulder uh and you sling this thing around it's got a uh pocket right here uh, for your concealed carry and uh, you, it's real accessible to, to get to your weapon there so I always keep my pistol in the the uh, concealed carry area um, we'll go over a few things that I have in this bag you know you think this bag is not too big but uh, it's a pretty good size bag guys once you get it on your shoulder um, like I said up here what I keep up here is a uh, keep a pair of safety glasses I keep a, a pair of uh, earplugs. Uh, I keep a, a little bit of a 550 paracord. Um, we'll go to this uh, next one right here. I keep a little bit of hand sanitizer. Uh, I keep a, a some Garmin GPS Venture HD. You don't have to keep this in the EDC carry, but uh, hunt season is in, and I use this to mark my stands and all guys. So right now I'm keeping that in there. Uh, that's that's everything out of that little area. Uh, I keep a handkerchief. I keep a, a little bit of fire tender here in this one, and a couple uh, a little bit of lint here. Uh, I keep some duct tape, uh, about five foot of duct tape. Uh, I have my uh, little survival whistle, and it hangs in there in case I need to use it for a signal I also keep a Gerber multi tool in there I keep a couple cliff bars in there uh, that's like I said inside of there guys is a couple pockets uh, got some good Alaska in here where you can stick these little uh, older medicine bottles that I have there uh, for your main compartment uh, I keep in uh, keep my fire starter in here got a uh, little sparky in here cigarette lighter you always want to make sure it's orange so you can uh if you drop it on the ground it's very easy to identify and locate and uh i got a, a little uh fire starter aviation survival spark light in here also uh, very good flashlight i'm gonna do a review on this flashlight uh you got the the front one then uh, you got a side one, and if you know if, if you're walking a trail, guys, you can uh, actually hook this here on the side, like this right here. And uh, as you tote this thing, it can give you some pretty good light. So this is a very good light right here. I keep keep that in the bag also. Uh, I keep uh, a couple notepads in here. Uh, a good little buck uh, knife, like I said, a notepad. Uh, keep an SOL uh, survival blanket. Uh, it will. Uh, you can use it for two people. Very good, uh, reliable survival blanket, guys. I recommend to get a couple of these and throw them in your car, your bikes, your ATVs, your EDC bags, your 72-hour bug out bag. These these are very handy. You can make shelters. Actually, it's got a. Uh, a lot of survival tips this this on the uh the uh blanket itself so very handy to have 
I got a, a, a Morris. I'm gonna do a review on it. Uh, some Mora, excuse me, some Mora uh, bushcraft knife. Just got this in. Uh, like I said, I got uh, pins, permanent markers. I got all this stuff in, in uh, this thing. This is what I carry every day, guys. Plus, I keep a couple uh, Kershaw knives on me. I also keep a flashlight on my side at all times. This bag right here, guys, is, is very rugged. It's got some molly uh, attachments to it for the outside. I also keep a, uh, got a little medical bag that I keep hooked in my molly bag. Uh, evidently, I must have left it at the house, or in the house, excuse me. Uh, I go, I do a review on that one day. Like I said, very good, guys. This, this is a, a four or five star bag. I love it. You can pick this bag up on a Sportsman Guide, uh, $22.95. They do have it in different colors, for a little bit more higher. I think it's up. It's like a, another uh, five bucks or so. So guys, look at the Sportsman's Guide and look at this uh, this bag. It's a it's a red red rock by Outdoor uh, Gear. Check it out, guys. Be safe. God bless America. Thanks.